Welcome on another Fishy Friday here at Bart's Fishtails. We are in Amsterdam right now and really exciting. We are flying out to Australia. We have teamed up with Etihad Airways and they will take us to Perth. Then we will travel through to Exmouth where we're going to do some stunning sustainable prawn fishing. Let's go. Welcome back seafood lovers on another Fishy Friday here at Bart's Fishtails. Today really exciting. I'm at the west coast of Australia. I'm in Exmouth. And what's going on here? They're one of the most beautiful sustainable prawn fisheries in the world. Last night we've caught these beautiful tigers. We're going to make skewers. We're going to barbecue them and serve them with a pineapple chutney. Okay, so let's kick off by cleaning, peeling, uh, cutting the pineapple. So make sure you have removed all the brown points and then you cut the, well, the outside of the pineapple. So you leave, you leave the heart, you're not using the heart of the pineapple. So I have these aside. So next one, slice a red chili. So I slice it thin, but I leave the seeds in. And now I'm going to add an onion. I'm starting simmering the chili and the onion in a bit of vegetable oil. And make sure it's not going to caramelize. It can give a bitter taste to the chutney later on. So I am adding now the pineapple, the cubes. Lovely. So we are simmering this all together with the pineapple, now it's time for sugar. We're going to add three tablespoons of sugar. No chutney without sugar. Three. Fresh ginger, and I grate it like a two centimeter piece into the chutney. I add a bit of salt. There we go. One of the meals of vinegar, give it a bit of acidity and 100 ml of water. Okay, so because I need some space, I'm going to change uh, pans. So I have the upcoming chutney. I pour it over into this small saucepan, and then I bring it to boil and leave it there for 20 minutes. So the next step is the prawns. We have some beautiful tigers here, and I love tiger prawns. These are wild prawns and they're MSC certified, which means they are caught in a sustainable way. The stock of the, of the prawns are, is really healthy. Um, there's a very limited bycatch. Um, this is the way how we need to go for the future in terms of sustainable fishing. Beautiful, beautiful prawns from the west coast of Australia. So add them to a bowl, a bit of vegetable oil, some salt, and I give this a toss. Okay, prawns. I'll have three prawns on a skewer. I start on the tail side, press it through the head. Look at this, amazing. Three, the third skewer. So this chutney is almost ready. I'm going to crush the pineapple. I crush the chili and the onion that these get well infused and combined but I, I don't want to have like a very smooth uh, uh, chutney. I want to have like these bits and pieces. I want to have it like a bit rustic. Um, I'm almost there. And then we make sure that the liquid, which is still on top, will uh, evaporate. And then your chutney is ready. We're going to grill the prawns. Tiger prawns, wild caught, freshly caught, and sustainable. So we have like nine prawns here, three skewers, and I have them on the barbie. The temperature of your barbecue should be really, really uh, on top, uh, very high. And we will grill them for like two and a half, three minutes each side. Okay, so it's time to turn them around. Oh, wow, look at this. Amazing, fantastic. I will add some lime and I'm going to ask David. Guys, you will remember David Loftus of one of the earlier videos we shot in India. Actually, we're here to shoot these amazing videos, but also uh, to create a new chapter in my Bart's Fishtails cookbook. And David, obviously, is the photographer. 
So we just move them a little bit to there. And we have here the beautiful color of the shrimp, David. Amazing. Shall I ask, add a bit of green, nice freshness, a bit of lime zest. Prawns are ready. So I take them off. I have them on my plate. So the last step, I'm going to roast some flake almonds. Give it maybe 30 seconds until they get a little tiny bit golden brown. Okay, good. Chutney almost ready. Uh, prawns are sitting here. Um, it's time to serve the chutney. And on top of the chutney, I have some lime zest. So just decorated with some coriander leaves and a bit of spring onion. Nice, crunchy, bit fresh. Okay, last step, the almonds. Nice spoon, there we go. It's 42 degrees Celsius on the west coast of Australia, but I've got prawns. I've got beautiful, fresh, caught, uh, sustainable prawns. I'm going to have a taste. So if you eat prawns from the barbie, um, you obviously use your hands. So I take the head off, great. Peel them. Beautiful white flesh. It's amazing. I'm going to give it a dip into this chutney and have a taste. Mmm. Mmm. The, the softness of the meat, the juiciness of the meat of this prawn is amazing. And this chutney, which has, has a bit of acidity, the vinegar, uh, a bit of the sugar sweetness, but also sugar uh, out of the pineapple uh, sweetness. Um, we have the onion and the kick of the, of the chili. And this, this is a great harmony all together. We have cooked it for like 20 minutes and it's amazing if you just dip a tiny bit because the, the prawn is the real hero today. You want to taste the true taste of the sea here from the west coast of Australia. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, any comments, leave them in the box down below. Don't forget to subscribe and see you soon on another Fishy Friday.